this week at Christ Memorial as we talk about restoring and rebuilding the rubble that we've run to, I want to talk about fear. Fear is only reasonable when the object I'm afraid of is present and powerful. If I look down in this grass and I see a garter snake, I really don't need to be afraid, even though I may be star startled. It's a garter snake. It's not powerful. If I hear a rattlesnake off in the distance, it's powerful, but it's not present. I still don't need to be afraid. However, if I looked at the base of this tree and in the grass and I saw a rattlesnake next to my feet, it is very reasonable and probably advisable for me to be afraid. How many of the things in our life that we fear are either neither present nor powerful or either one, but we live trapped in a fear that keeps us from experiencing the love of other people and the love of God? We're going to answer that question and we're going to understand what it means to defeat fear in the presence of God so that we don't have to give in to those things in our life that are paralyzing. It's all there in the book of Nehemiah. We're continuing our journey, so be part of it. Part of running to the rubble and overcoming our fear. We'll see you at 9 and 11 on Sunday.